What's up guys, and today I'm bringing you another Call of Duty Ghost Chem Strike. This time it is with the heavy metal camo, and I don't really like this camo, I think it's too unorganized, if that makes sense. It's just a bunch of shit that I can't really like make out sometimes, but I don't know, it's a cool, it's a cool camo, but you know, I don't really like it, if that makes sense, I don't know. But anyway, so yeah, um, it's really, this video is really kind of short because I do get, I don't get all of the gameplay recorded because I was running low on memory at this time. And so I only got like the first most of the kill streak, and I got like the end of the last game, uh, at the, like the last part of the game. So as you can see, when I started the game, I had 16 kills, and then at the end of the game, I have 46, so that's 30. And also you can see that I have like the map is like chem strike and stuff like that. So I mean I don't really get the chem strike, but I'm showing you proof like at the very end I do get the chem strike. Not that that really matters at all, but yeah. So, what I am running is the Honey Badger with Grip and the Extended Mags with Marathon, Dead Silence, Stalker, Amplify, and Focus. My first three unlocks are Scavenger, Dead Eye, and Hardline. And my bonus consists of Slide Hand, Blind Eye, Blast Shield, and Ping. So, yeah, like this said, this is a quick uh, chem strike with. I was playing with one other, I believe. And so, yeah, we were just tearing lobbies up. And so, yeah. And what I want to talk about for this video is Cinch Gaming, which is my newest sponsorship. And if you guys don't know what that is, that's what I'm here to talk about. They're basically a company that makes controllers and like some appar apparel as well, like t-shirts and stuff like that. But what really makes them stand out from like other major controller companies is that they have like cheap prices too. Like, like you can get a scuff for like 100 50, 70, 80, something like that dollars, which is actually quite expensive, but you can get a Cinch Gaming controller for Xbox 360 for like half of that, and that's what I really do like. Unfortunately, I do not have one of these controllers because I do have a scuff myself, and I have like another generic controller that works just like that with paddles and stuff. So, I mean, like I'm pretty set for now, but you know, these controllers don't last forever, but if I do break my stuff or something by accident, I will probably get a Cinch since they're really cheap. And it works just the same. Like they're like they're these controllers are all the same, um, basically. So plus like they have different paddles in the back. Like instead of it being like a whole paddle, it's just like a little button, which actually makes it. Which actually it's a good idea since you don't have to like reach. Um, so yeah, the link will, from that will be in the description if you guys want to go click the link, and you know find out all the reasons why Cinch Gaming is really a good company to get controllers from. And if you guys do want to get anything, you, you can try and support me by using my uh, coupon code, the Beast, which will give you 5% off your purchase, which is kind of a lot for like an $80 controller. If you guys think of it that way, I think it's like, I don't know how much it is, $4? I don't know. I I don't know. I can't really make math. Yeah, $4. Something like, I don't know. Don't, I don't know. Something like that. So yeah, all right, it will take, it's considerably cheaper. And that's like one of the main reasons is, you know, weird. Like, I'm not a professional gamer or anything, so I'm not really going to tournaments. So I don't need like an expensive scuff or anything. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, right here's the end of the video. You guys see the Chem Strike map, and I'll replay this clip again. So, let's see if we can get at least 15 likes in this video. That'd be really appreciated. And, you know, I'll see you guys on the next video.